Hi, I'm Riley from Active Galactic Videos. I'm a student telescope operator for the Kuiper 61 inch telescope, and tonight I'll be taking you through a typical night of observing. I try to arrive at the telescope a few hours before sunset to get everything set up for the night's observations. I start by turning on the uninterrupted power supply and plugging everything in inside the downstairs control room. The control room is where I spend a majority of my time while running the telescope during the night. After powering on all of the computers in the control room, I will head upstairs into the dome where the telescope is housed. Here, I'll turn on the power to the dome itself so that it will be able to open and rotate throughout the night. I will then plug in and turn on all of the cameras, computers, and other equipment, such as the filter wheel that is mounted on the telescope. The next thing that needs to be done is called filling the doer. We take our science images using a CCD camera that must be kept very cold. If the camera is too warm, the data will be far too noisy to use for research purposes. The CCD camera is mounted on the bottom of the telescope, sealed in a vacuum, and in order to keep it cold enough to take good images, it is housed above a doer that is then filled with liquid nitrogen. It is important to always keep the doer filled with enough liquid nitrogen that the camera does not start to warm up. Once the doer is filled, I'll have to wait until dusk to begin opening the dome and the telescope mirror covers in order to gather data for the night. The mirror covers are always the last thing to open at the beginning of the night and the first thing to close at the end of the night because it's very important to protect the telescope mirror. When everything is ready upstairs, I will head back into the control room and use the various computers to run the camera and telescope systems and take data for the rest of the night. It can take quite a few minutes to point the telescope at the object that is being observed that night and get everything focused and set up to begin recording data. Typically, if the weather permits, observations will run from shortly before sunset to just after sunrise, or what astronomers like to call astronomical twilight. The Kuiper Telescope is used by a variety of students and faculty at the University of Arizona and several other institutions. There is a lot of really great science being done using data from this telescope and a multitude of research groups working on all sorts of interesting topics. A few of these topics include exoplanet atmospheres characterization, variable stars and stellar evolution, and even recent supernovas. Thanks for joining me at the telescope. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share Active Galactic videos. Bye!